We're going to disassemble the needle bar mechanism, the thread take up lever, and the counterweight. We're going to remove the needle, the needle set screw, and the thread guide. Remove the upper oil cap. Loose the needle bar clamp. Lift the needle bar. Place a screwdriver underneath. Now you can remove it. Remove the needle clamp and the sliding block. The, the screw for the connecting rod has a reverse thread, so to remove it, turn clockwise and remove the screw. Then the connecting rod comes out. Next, please remove the two oil caps in order to be able to remove the thread take up lever. Next, loosen the set screw for the upper portion of the thread take up system. Next, we're going to remove the needle bar crank, who has two screws here on the side. One is an Allen 3mm screw and the other one is a standard head screw. This is the standard head screw and the next one over it's the 3mm Allen head. Before removing the upper portion of the thread take up, please remove the wick for lubrication, which is located underneath the top cover in this oil terminal. This is the one. Use a bigger screw. At this point now it can be removed. This time we're going to remove the counterweight. With the, there are two screws that hold the counterweight. One is a 3mm Allen head screw and the other one is a standard head screw that goes through the shaft. Once the two screws are removed the best way to remove it is by using a soft metal to top it out. Turn the hand wheel and heat it from the other end. 